Hey guys, Alvin. In this video, I'll show you a detailed tutorial on how to do the trending iOS 16 features you can use for your IG stories. For the first edit, we're gonna do an easy lyrics depth effect. Okay, first, import a photo to your IG story. Then you're gonna click on the widgets icon. Then go to music and choose a song that you like. Once you have chosen, you're gonna position the lyrics at the level of your head in the photo. Next, go to your gallery and select the same photo that you uploaded. Then press and hold to copy. Go back to your Instagram, allow paste, then add sticker. Now this step is a little hard. You need patience for this if you wanna make it perfect. But the trick is to just make the overlay a little bigger than the original. It's easier like that. And we're done. The effect is like you have the depth effect of the new iOS 16 update for your iPhone's lock screen, but it's lyrics and you can use it as an IG story. Next idea is a collage using iOS cutout feature for your new post. You can share new posts or any posts from your feed, then go to your gallery, then copy subjects from the photos that are related to your main post, then paste them as a collage in your IG story. You can use photos that are related to your main post. This is a very cool idea to give your viewers some context of what the main post is all about. Now we're going to do a clickable new post using the dev effect. In this edit idea, we're going to use the same cutout feature but for a clickable new post. So we're going to share a new post to IG story, then we're going to go to widgets, then upload a photo that is related to the main post. Next, we're gonna go to draw and use the ink dropper to choose to color at the bottom of the photo that we just uploaded. Then we're gonna press and hold anywhere in the screen to fill the background with the color that we just selected. Then we're gonna place the clickable new post at the bottom. Then we're gonna zoom out the photo that we uploaded to fill in the entire screen except for the bottom part so we can click and bring up the new post. We change the background color so that the background that's still showing would look like it's part of the photo. And now we're gonna go to gallery to get a copy of cutout of the photo. Then we're gonna align the cutout with the original photo to give the depth effect while the new post is still clickable. Now we're gonna do a magazine style IG story idea still with the depth effect and clickable IG feed post. So this is basically a different style on how you can utilize these new features. So first, share a post to IG story. Then go to your gallery and select a photo, then crop it into a square. Now go to widgets to import the photo that you just edited. Then we're going to do the same technique, zooming out the photo to fill in the screen and bringing up the clickable IG post from the bottom part. We're going to resize the IG post to the smallest size and we're going to place it at the bottom right. Now we're going to add the magazine details. We're going to start with the cover name of the magazine. We're going to place it over the head so we can do the depth effect. Then go to gallery and get a cutout copy of the photo, paste the cutout and do the aligning thing again. Once done, you can now add more magazine details. So I'm adding a GIF barcode. Then I'm gonna write new post. plus the month and the year to date. There are other ways you can enjoy and utilize the new iOS 16 features. You just need your creativity and have fun with it. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comment section what iOS 16 features are your favorite. And if you want more videos like this, go to my main page and watch other tutorials.